Okay, today we're looking at a new Rainbow High Doll Mini Choi. This is from one of the Rainbow Vision bands. Um, this is the K-pop band Royal 3. I don't know anything about K-pop, so there might be a lot of clever references in this doll that go over my head, but we will take a look. Um, this is Minnie in her second outfit. I've already taken her out of the one she was packaged in, but we'll take a look at both of them here. She's got a headband with RH on it. As I understand it, they don't actually go to Rainbow High. They go to a different school in Korea, so I'm not exactly sure if it makes sense that she's wearing a Rainbow High headband. Got this microphone ear thingy. Her color is called lavender pink or something, so it is a very light lavenderish pinkish color. This outfit has the black and pearl accents, some knitting, and she, she's got some really nice detailing on her hands. There's multiple rings on each hand and even some little nail decorations at the tip. So they put a lot of design into just the hands. Um, here's her shoes and socks. That finally stuff is not going to age well. It always gets flaky with time, but it looks pretty for now. Um, her hair doesn't have too much product in it, so that's good. There's some a uh, little bit of crunchiness at the ends, but I was able to comb through it. And it looks a lot better now. Okay, here she is back in her first outfit. The detailing on these boots is really nice. We've got the skirt with zippers. They're not functional, but they've got the individual zipper pulls, so that's neat. Uh, she's got a halter top with a jacket. I had some of these pearls already pop off. Looks like they're just glued on, so watch out for that. That was kind of disappointing. we got some tassels. And then she has this t-shirt of her with her bandmates, so that kind of makes a third outfit. You can pair that with either skirt. Now, there are these little fingerless glove thingies, and I don't see how it's possible to put them on her hands. For one thing, there's a lot of jagged points with the rings and nails, so I'm afraid of it getting caught and cut on something but in order for it to go on you have to like push the th thumb in and that it just doesn't seem to be enough space to allow for it and you can't just go in like you can't take the hand off and put it in from behind i don't think that would work so yeah i'm gonna leave these off because i can't figure out how they could possibly go back on and she's got a uh, stand and comb, no hangers in this release. And she's got this little booklet with some nice pictures, some song lyrics. Some nice signatures and holographic lettering, so that's fun. So yeah, that's Minnie. Uh, I think she's really pretty and nice quality. Uh, I think the makeup is pretty even. I don't know. Oh, I don't know. The glitter might be a little uneven, but I don't. I don't really see the errors in paint jobs as much as some collectors do. I just. I just don't notice it. I don't know. That part of my brain isn't focusing on those details. So you'll have to tell me if her eyes are wonky. I think she looks okay. Um, but yeah, there were the pearls that were already popping off of this jacket. So that, that was the main disappointment here. Everything else looks good. Oh, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed or tolerated, um, leave a like and subscribe. See you next time. Bye.